So in this video, we're going to go through this example where we have the curve y equals log base 10 of x plus k crosses the y-axis at 4 log base 10 of 5, take away open bracket 1 half log base 10 of 64, take away 1 third log base 10 of 729,000, take away 2, close the bracket. Find the value of k and hence sketch the curve. OK, so the first thing that we really need to do is to simplify this down. So if I could write that as a single logarithm, that would be really useful. So first of all, let's deal with the numbers in front of the logarithms. So the 4 can come up to the power here, and I can write that as log base 10 of 5 to the 4. Now, I'm also going to expand that bracket out. So take away and bring that half up to the power of the 64. So log base 10 of 64 to the half. Take away minus, so plus. Bring the third up to the power. So log base 10 of 729,000 to the one third. Then take away minus 2, so plus, And the 2... I can write as log base 10 of 10 squared. So that's utilizing, remember, log base b of b to the x is x. So let's see what we have here. Now, 5 to the power of 4. This is log base 10 of 625. Take away log base 10 of 64 to the half, which is 8. Then we have 729,000 to the power of 1 third is 90. So that's log base 10 of 90. And then we've got plus log base 10 of 100. So working from left to right, so focus on these two first. We're going to have log base 10 of 625 over 8 using the quotient rule. Now because they're all added together, we can do this all in one go if we want. So that'd be log base 10 of 625 over 8 times by 90 times by 100. So log base 10 of, so 625 over 8 times by 90 times by 100, and that's 703,125. Okay. Now, it crosses the y-axis at that point. So that will be when x is 0. So that means that k must be 703,125. So if that is the case, then it will have a vertical asymptote at x equals minus 703,125 because that value will make that bracket 0. Now, this is going to be a positive value. So that means our curve, if I can try not draw it so poorly, will look something like that. So this point here is our log base 10 of 703,125. OK. And this point here, where it crosses the x-axis, is when y is 0, which would need our bracket to be equal to 1. OK, because it will be 10 to the 0 is 1. So if k is that, then this value will need to be minus 703,125. 
and 24 because that value plus that will make one. And so that is my sketch.